what I will do is explain one of the sample questions that I got in the email from one of the students and see how to solve this problem. Okay? All right. Let's do that right now. What we have is a question where we're supposed to simplify the following expression, and this is what it is. It's 4i divided by 5 plus 3i. Uh, how do we simplify 4i plus 5? Oh, I mean 4i divided by 5 plus 3i. So the first thing we need to, we need to do is to be able to get rid of the imaginary expression in the denominator. So what we do is we multiply this fraction by the conjugate of the denominator. So if you've got a 5 plus 3i, its conjugate would be 5 minus 3i. So let's go ahead and multiply. Um, we multiply that. It becomes 5 minus 3i at the top, multiply by 5 minus 3i at the bottom as well, because you want to make sure when you're multiplying an expression, you don't want to change the expression. You have to multiply it by, an ex by something that is equal to 1, okay? So why are we using the complex conjugate? Because we know that if we multiply 5 plus 3i, and 5 minus 3i, we're going to get a difference between squares. So that's 25 plus 9. And of course, why it's a difference, because when you get the minus 9i squared, it becomes positive 9, since i squared is negative 1. Okay, so this is now equal to 34. All right. So what we're going to do is we rewrite this now as 4i times 5 minus 3i, whole thing divided by 34 because we've already simplified the denominator. Okay, and this is just uh, multiplying 4i through the difference. So we've got 4i times 5 is 20i, and then negative 12i squared because you've got 4i times 3i gives us. Uh, 4i times negative 3i, I mean, will give us negative 12i, right, divided by 34. And of course, that's equal to, now we split this into two fractions, it becomes 20i over 34. And then minus, now, remember that i squared is a negative 1, so minus 12 over 34 times a negative 1. So now this becomes a real part of this expression. I'm going to put it in the front. So now it becomes positive 12 over 34 because negative times negative is positive plus 20i over 34. Now do you think this is the final answer? Well we got to simplify first and reduce this into its lowest fraction so divide both the top and bottom by 2. So that becomes um, 6 over 17 plus divide by 2, 10 over 17i. And that gives you the final answer to this problem. The end.